we have sad news in the world of acting. Um, Norman Lloyd has died. Um, he was one. Of the, um, he was around forever, basically, and he was actually one of the oldest actors to die. He died yesterday. Finally, at 106 years old. Um, but I'm gonna assume that because they don't have um, a cause of death, it was just old age. He was 106. I said, "What else would you want from that?" Um, so he lived a good long life. But he's most memorable for his roles in St. Elsewhere. Um, he was also, um, um, he also was known for his role as playing the president in Rocky and Bullwinkle. He was also known for playing in, the, in, the, in um, I think it's, I can't remember, it's Amityville Horror. There was a, there was a, there was like a movie back in the 80s. I think it was a made for TV one called the, I think it was Amityville Horror. I can't remember for sure exactly offhand. And then he was also known for his role in L.J. Rose. And then he was also known, but his last movie that he did was back in 2015 when he was like 101 years old, and he appeared in the movie Trainwreck back in 2015, which was the last movie he did. Um, but you got to give it up for the guy though too. Not only was he 106 when he, um, um, not only was he 106 years old when he died yesterday, he was married to his wife for 75 years. Um, he got married to his wife Peggy in 1936. And they remained married until until 2011, when she died at the, at the age of 98. Um, so they were married a long time. He got married to her really young. He was 21 when he got married to his wife. And they remained married until 2011. The only other person I know that's pulled that off is Jimmy Carter, the president. But they but 75 years is a pretty good run for being married. Most marriages don't even last that fucking long. Um... Not yet. But I have to look up... I had to look up... I should have looked up more stuff on him, though, to make sure what other movies and stuff he's been in. But he had... But he was acting for over 70 years, but he only had, like... He only had, like, 68 acting roles. Which, too many people, if you've been acting for 70, 80 years, you should have had more acting roles than that. But, that, but you know, not always the case. And I don't even know if I would want to live that long either, because 106 years old is kind of a long time. And if I ever did live to be 106, most of the people I know would be dead by now anyway.